Some hunters are better than others, and some animals are better at finding escape routes. All this to say that nothing is ever guaranteed in the bush. But if you're curious to see how some of these encounters unravel, it's time because we're getting started. Number 15, Wild Dog Hunting Warthog. When these wild dogs come across another warthog, they were on their third warthog hunt of the day. They started by wearing down the warthog until it was exhausted, at which point they started tearing flesh from its body. For some reason, they stopped attacking the warthog and the warthog decided to flee, but it went looking for the dogs in the tall grass, which I don't understand. This was a strange hunt, if you ask me. When the dogs abandoned the kill, the prey wanted to approach the predators. This warthog was obviously a masochist, confused, or simply deranged. During this remarkable sighting, wildlife enthusiasts watched the astonishing teamwork and strategy of a pack of African wild dogs. They had spent hours on the hunt with the pack the previous evening and much of the morning without success. The pack then encountered a powerful warthog, which they were cautiously probing when they discovered there was a young warthog in the burrow. After the discovery, it became a patient approach of organized chaos until they finally isolated their target outside the burrow and finally gained nourishment. These wild dogs are on the prowl, but it seems like the warthogs they're after are constantly outsmarting them, which, to say the least, means a lot because wild dogs are as efficient as predators can be in the bush. It looks like a game to the warthog, but if it is, it's definitely one of survival. Wild dogs on the prowl usually chase their prey and devour it in seconds. And it's no different in this video after several dogs take down a large warthog and eat it alive. During an ambush, several adult warthogs try to fend off a wild dog invasion, but the canines still manage to pull a young warthog out of the den dragging it out of there with reckless abandon and devouring it alive. Number 14, Lion Attacks Buffalo. Three male lions attack an adult buffalo in this video. After a few minutes and a fierce fight, the buffalo manages to escape. During the fight, one of the lions was injured as he was penetrated by the horns of the buffalo. It's not always fun in games for lions hunting and this incident proves it. Cape buffaloes are extremely powerful and dangerous and are the sworn enemies of lions, but it doesn't stop lions from hunting them just like the lion in this video when the feline tackles the large prey like some of the best NFL linebackers I've seen. The large pride of lions in this video is all over a mighty Cape buffalo, but the buffalo is ready for the fight and tells the lions to bring it on. It seems like the lions take the buffalo's words at heart and boy do they ever bring it on, resulting in the death of the animal. The entire pride, including sub-adults and young cubs, sit at the dining room table preparing themselves to enjoy an amazing buffalo meal. The larger lions prep their steak because one of the lions like it medium rare. Lions are expert hunters and the Cape Buffalo is prime prey for these lords of the jungle. You can see four male lions attacking, killing, and eating a Cape Buffalo in this video, and boy are they enjoying every second of this meal. Number 13, Lion Hunting Zebra. After taking a feisty zebra down, a few lions hold the animal down while one of them chokes it to death. The other lions begin to eat the zebra while it's still alive and fighting to escape, but that's not going to happen. Lions take down a large zebra and turn it around, holding the animal on the ground, making sure it can't get back up as the zebra fights hard until it is flipped over on its back, taking its last breath. During their morning game drive, wildlife enthusiasts saw a group of lions attacking zebras during daylight. After the lions caught one zebra, they started eating while the zebra was still alive, which occurs occasionally, but it is not common. Mom lets her cub learn how to kill during this hunt, as the little guy practices his skills on a zebra foal that's just the right size for the feline to train. Every day, a female lion mother will leave her new cubs in a safe hiding place while she goes hunting. She transports the cubs by carrying them in her mouth by the scruff of their necks. The cubs appear to relax their muscles naturally when being carried, 
making the transit process easier for them and their mother. Once the cubs are ready to learn how to hunt, which is around six weeks old, their mothers place them in real life situations such as this one, and there is no better way to learn. Number 12, Hyena Hunting Zebra. These hyenas bite under the zebra's belly, looking for a soft spot where they can cut the zebra open and weaken it. The zebra tries to flee, but the hyenas grab a hold of it. When they finally take it down, they start by opening the animal's back before disemboweling it. The zebra is pregnant, so the hyenas get a two-for-one deal as they eat their prey alive. Nature is a brutal mistress, and only ensuring one's own existence is the kingly way. Many predators are simply concerned with maximizing their rewards and if they will be hurt or able to consume their prey. Competition is fierce in the African savanna where hyenas reside. Predators will steal food from one another. Other predators' food will be grabbed by hyenas, but hyenas' food will also be grabbed. As a result, they can only ensure their own safety as soon as possible. Only if the prey reaches your stomach can you truly count yourself. In general, hyenas catch less lethal prey, such as zebras and gazelles. Because these preys are relatively mild and their lethality is low, there is no need to eliminate them altogether and hyenas are not as strong as lions. Because their jaws can grip their prey tightly enough, the hyena simply needs to devour the prey faster to ensure its own safety without killing the animal before. It looks like a lioness managed to persuade some hyenas that they could share a meal together, even though the two species are sworn enemies. I guess when starvation is the common denominator, rivalries are thrown out the window. The hyenas in this video are waiting on the sidelines until a pride of lions finishes their zebra meal. We don't see the lions eating, but we do see a zebra trying to scare the scavengers away. Of course, it doesn't work because it will take a lot more than that to scare the hyenas away. A clan of hyenas is on the prowl, and once they isolate two zebras in the distance, they manage to take one down. The rest of the herd escapes, as none of the other zebras want to get close to the scavengers to help their friend. Number 11, Leopard and Cheetah Hunting Gazelle. A beautiful female leopard creeps out of the bush on an early morning and spots a group of unsuspecting impala and gazelle. Crouching stealthily in the long grass, the animal hunts, creeping closer and closer, waiting for the perfect moment, and then pounces swiftly on its prey. It then carries the carcass off into the bushes where it plays with it and begins to eat it. This cheetah mom of three cubs killed a pregnant Grant's gazelle. You can even see the baby kicking when the cheetah was choking the gazelle. She made sure she killed the gazelle and then dragged it to a nearby tree to keep it from the gathering vultures. While the cubs were getting down to business, eating the gazelle, an Egyptian cobra came to pay a visit, but the cats let the snake slither away without attacking it. The cheetah in this video is not sure where to start with this tiny gazelle, so I guess a few taps on the head might do, until the feline finally understands what to do and kills the prey. Cheetahs and leopards often behave this way with smaller prey for some reason. A leopard stalks a small gazelle, and when it goes for the kill, it strikes with surgical precision, and it's all over within seconds. There's one leopard that wasn't interested in playing around with his young prey before killing it. Number 10, Lion vs. Buffalo. In our thumbnail, a lion can be seen laying on the ground, probably dead, after messing around with a cape buffalo. As much as lions are deadly predators, they don't always win their battles, especially against a fierce animal like the Cape Buffalo. The male lion in this video tries to attack a buffalo for dinner. The lion wants to attack the buffalo from behind, but the large animal is intelligent and always remains facing the male lion. When a second buffalo comes charging, the feline has no other choice but to retreat. A lioness is threatened by an entire herd of buffaloes and she understands the message, so she moves away without hesitating. When the herd sticks together, it is difficult for lions to do anything. Number 9. Komodo Dragon Attacking Goat The Komodo in this video attacked the limping goat while resting and immediately tried to swallow it alive. The Komodo Dragon is the largest lizard in the world and has a unique way of eating as you just saw. Komodo dragons with their massive muscular bodies and highly venomous bites can take down prey several times their size including deer, pigs, water buffalo, and even humans. Komodo dragons are incredibly dangerous and venomous, thus it is advisable to avoid them. 
They are not recommended as pets because they are aggressive hunters and tough to tame. These beasts can be quite unsafe to keep around youngsters or even adults, particularly animals. Their moniker is appropriate as Komodo dragons are real predators that attack all types of animals in the wild, including humans. While the Komodo is not known to feed on humans, there have been reports of attacks and deaths. It's the first time I see a goat give a Komodo dragon so much trouble. Usually it's one, two, and three into the dragon's mouth it goes, but not in this case. I mean, yes, the result is going to be the same, but this goat fights hard and stands its ground against a more powerful animal. The Komodo needed to try, and from what I have seen in the past, I have never seen Komodos try to kill prey. It just comes naturally. This black goat is still alive, but the reason it's not trying to escape is because it's probably been already infected by the dragon's venom and is paralyzed, unable to move, hence giving the dragon an unwanted invitation to eat it. Number eight, cheetah leopard hunting rabbit. The young cheetahs are having the most trouble capturing this rabbit. The rabbit circles around them until the cheetahs realize what's going on. Because of their inexperience, they do not immediately make the kill, and the unfortunate rabbit desperately tries to free itself. It's only a matter of time before the rabbit is eaten by the cheetahs. Hares are not big prizes for large cats like leopards, but when it's all that's available, the feline needs to make the best of the situation. This leopard stalks a bunny rabbit, but when the big cat goes for the kill, he finds out sooner than later that the bunny is an expert high jumper with three gold medals and fails. Another rabbit dies after being hunted down by a cheetah. Except for their legs, which allow them to run quickly, rabbits have no defense mechanisms to protect themselves and cannot outrun a cheetah. In this video, you can see an Asiatic cheetah hunting and killing a rabbit. This cheetah looks slightly bigger than the African cheetah in my opinion. The Asiatic cheetah once roamed the grasslands of India, Pakistan, Russia, Iran, and the Middle East. Excessive hunting, habitat degradation, and a lack of prey species that have been hunted to near extinction by man have nearly wiped off the cats. There have been no sightings of large cats in Afghanistan since the 1950s and a 2001 investigation in Pakistan revealed no evidence of them. They used to migrate from Iran to Turkmenistan, but the installation of a border fence has made this natural movement more difficult. The cranium of the Iranian cheetah is smaller than those of its African counterparts. Their legs are shorter, their coats are thicker, and their necks are stronger. Iran's last wild Asiatic cheetahs are reported to number between 70 and 110 individuals, all of whom live on the remote and parched central plateau. The Iranian cheetah is considered a vital component of the country's natural and cultural legacy, and it has also become a symbol of the country's conservation efforts. The Iranian Ministry of Environment collaborated with numerous other organizations notably the Wildlife Conservation Society and the United Nations Development Program, to develop a comprehensive conservation program. Researchers are protecting the last remaining Iranian cheetahs, their prey base, and their natural habitats through this project by mitigating direct threats to cheetahs and their prey, collecting ecological data, improving and empowering law enforcement officials, using camera traps and radio collars to collect critical data on cheetah ecology, and working with local communities to improve attitudes towards the cats. Number seven, wild dog hunting water buck. This sequence shows the successful hunt of a pack of about 25 wild dogs taking down a female water buck at Jones's Dam in Kruger National Park. This pack of wild dogs first tried to catch a female water buck that placed her behind in a bush and kept the pack at bay until they lost interest and went looking for easier prey. On both occasions, the water buck raced down to Jones's dam, probably hoping to find water to take refuge in. The second victim tried the same but was not as lucky, and both she and her unborn calf were taken down and devoured in a very short time. It's all part of Nature Daily in Kruger National Park. This female water buck was lucky. She held her ground and the wild dogs eventually lost interest and went looking for easier prey. This scene played out in and around Jones's Dam in the iconic Kruger National Park. After watching a pack of wild dogs hunt a large herd of impala and missing, the canines bump into a mother and her calf water buck. 
After being chased into the water by the dogs, the little water bug manages to escape from a large pod of hippos that are not impressed with the disturbance in their water hole. After a few hours, the wild dogs give up and mom and her baby manage to escape unharmed. Number six, fox attacks chickens. When the fox in this video tries to find a way of getting into this chicken coop to grab a quick breakfast, he is stumped. He keeps going back and forth from side to side, but there is no way in. The chickens are well protected and the fox will have to settle for something else. A fox can be seen sneaking his head into a chicken coop, looking for a meal. In the end, the fox managed to kill six out of 10 hens, so it's safe to say it was a good day at the office for the predator. After a fox enters a chicken coop and snatches a chicken, he loses a chicken when he tries to make his escape, after which the other chickens gang up on him and chase him away. But only momentarily before the fox latches onto another chicken outside until the owner of the property scares the animal away. What a crazy scene. The fox that attacked the chickens hanging around outside their chicken coop at night ended up killing 75% of the chickens there. After the incident, the owner decided to keep his chickens inside the coop until morning. Number five, leopard hunting gazelle. This is clearly not the leopard's first rodeo. They knew exactly what to do when it came to this gazelle. They found it, they closed in on it, and even though the gazelle tried to run and fight, the leopards got the best of it in the end. At the end of the day, the predator got the best of the prey and nature keeps marching on. Number four, crocodile hunting wildebeest. The wildebeest in this video put up a solid fight for the better part of 15 minutes, and with a lot of perseverance, managed to escape death, even though the reptile almost tore out one of the animal's legs. The wildebeest migration is one of nature's most spectacular events, possibly the greatest spectacle on the planet. The world famous Mara River crossings are the result of an annual migration of 2.5 million animals across Kenya and Tanzania's plains. To enjoy the fresh green grass on the other side of Kenya's Mara River, all the animals must now cross the river. This is where the action takes place. This is the annual all-you-can-eat buffet for the crocodiles. Because the wildebeest continue to arrive, all the crocodiles must do is wait and eat. This crocodile is making the most of the fact that this wildebeest is caught between a rock and a hard place. Because the wildebeest is small, the crocodile takes it in its mouth and lifts it into the air before dragging it through the water to eat. Number three, crocodile hunting warthog. This warthog is enjoying a refreshing drink of water when a crocodile emerges from the water. To avoid being crushed by the massive reptile, the warthog uses incredible footwork and manages to escape. It's amazing how many warthogs walk over to this water hole to drink and none of them are snatched by the crocodile. One warthog even positions himself right above the crocodile, but the reptile doesn't move and when he does, the warthog can easily avoid being caught. It looks like this warthog turned into a quick meal for this massive crocodile. The reptile can be seen walking out of the water with the dead animal in its mouth before it stops walking and lays there without moving for a bit. Suddenly, it begins to walk again, this time on the road, probably looking for a better spot to eat. Number two, lion hunting warthog. After a young male lion manages to pull a warthog out of its den, it must battle hard to keep the animal under control while it kills it, which is exactly what it does. Two lionesses ambush and eat a naive warthog in this video. I say naive because the warthog walked right into the lion's trap without concern even though he spotted them beforehand. In this video, a few lions ambush and attack a warthog. The warthog isn't very big, and with two felines on top of it, it's quite difficult for the animal to escape. The warthog quickly turns into a hot dog when the lions sink their powerful jaws into its tender meat, no buns required. Number one, Pitbull attacks and kills cow. The pit bull in this video literally slices the cow's throat open until it bleeds to death. This is tragic and mind-blowing, and even though someone tries to scare the dog away, his attempt, at best, is futile and useless and doesn't work. In this video, a few people team up to stop a pit bull from doing the same thing the pit bull in the previous video did. Fortunately, they managed to take control of the dog and the cow survives. It's obvious that predators don't care about the feelings of the animals they attack. They will kill and eat their prey no matter what. Which one was your favorite? 
why don't you let us know in the comments below. Well, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be a part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. Thanks for watching and see you next time.